Hi! I guess that's... That's the whole point of this video. Hi! I'm gonna be complaining about, really. I just wanna talk to you. Well, actually, there are things that I'm gonna complain about because that's what I usually do. I, actually, I complain about things all the time. So yeah, I will be complaining. Sorry, I'll take that back. But yeah, I was just wondering how you guys are doing. Let me know in the comments down below how you feel. How are you feeling, bruh? How are you doing? So, basically, uh, first things first, if you're Dutch and you're over 18, make sure to go vote on the 15th. It's time for us to vote, it's time to do something for your country. If you are over 18, you are eligible to vote, and you live in Holland, you are Dutch, make sure to use that right. Go out, vote, make a change for yourself, no matter what you vote, even though if you vote for current prime minister again, then seriously, you are not my friend. I know YouTubers aren't supposed to talk about politics because it's out of their league and we're too stupid to understand, but holy shit, if our current prime minister gets re-elected, I'm moving to America because Trump is a whole lot better than him. But yeah, make sure to go out and vote if you're in Holland, if you're Dutch, and if you're eligible to do so. If you don't know who to vote for, then make sure to click the link down in the description. I'll leave a link so you can test it out. Make sure to do it. It's important. Step up for your country. If you're not Dutch, that doesn't matter to you. I mean, you could still try that. You could still try that link. Don't think you can read it, but <laughs> you might as well give it a go. I think politics are important. I think it's important to educate people on politics. And I think that wherever you are, if you have a say, which you should have, to my personal opinion, you should take it, you know, you should use it. I think politics are, we are the future. Use your right to vote, you know? It's very important that everyone makes a say, but as my audience is usually mostly younger people, uh, people who aren't eligible to vote yet, I'm just saying it, you know, when you get to that time, make sure to at least dig into politics a, a tiny little bit. Make sure you know the basics of it. Make sure you know what you stand for and who to vote for if you want someone that stands for that as well. It's your future. It's the future of your entire nation. Make sure to know what you're doing. I, it's just a tip, but it's really, it's important to at least know something and to be interested in just a tiny little bit, just to know what your future can hold and who you should give that future to, because that's basically what you're doing when you vote. Now, another thing that the channel has not been running as well. I've said this multiple times, it happened multiple times, but it's, it's just, it's, it's not really getting better overall. There are some small spikes when all of a sudden videos get a couple dozen views and I'm like, hey, it fixed itself. And then like a couple days later, it will be back to like under 10 views. And I'll be like, well, yeah, no, that I'm still depressed. Like, I don't know what's happening because the, the amount of subscribers is growing. Like I have almost, we've got almost 500 subscribers here now. Where is everybody? Like, where are you guys? Why are you, you know, watching my videos? And I'm, I don't mean it in like a cynical, sarcastic way. I'm, I'm legitimately asking you, why are you not watching the videos? I mean, if you even see this at all, then I would very much like you to let me know. Are you too busy? Don't you have time? Which is also probably when you won't see this, but that's fine. If you do, and you might see this, uh, possibly just, you know, in between doing homework or whatever, you, you, you just don't have time to watch other videos normally, then let me know in the comments as well. Or any anything, any reason as of why you're not watching my videos anymore, of why you're not as interested anymore, or never have been, in the case, why are you here? But, you know, it's depressing to just see that you put in work in a video, and you try very hard, especially the Subnautica videos, they take hours and hours to record, uh, to get things done, and they take, um, well, the same amount of time basically to edit them down, because you have to go through all the footage and see what's good, and see what to cut out, and, you know, it's a lot of work to produce those videos and all these videos take a lot of editing time take a lot of time in general and i put in my love and my effort in it and you just don't see that being complimented by views by people commenting on them liking them you know leaving you feedback letting them know they appreciate it that that just it doesn't feel very nice so again if there's any reason of why you're not watching my videos anymore or why you're not as interesting to you anymore or anything then please let me know in the comments down below i'd fairly much appreciate that Another thing, and I'm not sure if I've already talked about it, is on this channel, I have two channels now, it's so confusing, I lose track of what I do on both channels all the time. I don't know if I said this on this channel or the other channel or anything, but I have a Patreon account as well now. If you're interested in helping me, supporting me in any way you can afford or you can spare, then feel free to go to my Patreon account, link is down in the description. You don't have to do that, even though I would fairly appreciate it if people checked it out and just, you know, had a look and see what I would offer and see, or just check it out in general, consider it, that will be be very appreciated as well but you don't you don't you don't have to it's not like you need to do that to watch exclusive content or to get any exclusive things but yeah if you're interested in my patreon account the link is down in the description i advise you to check it out it would be fairly appreciated if you did and you know if you can spare something that that would make my day week or maybe even year depending on the amount of course
I've been very busy playing Horizon Zero Dawn. I think I've racked up about 35 to 40 hours in the game now. I'm f I think I'm getting pretty close to the end. I think there's like two more main quests for me to do. And afterwards, of course, there's still uh, all of these side things and, and, and hunting grounds and all the things if you have played the game. Um, so there are still like a good 10 hours in the game for me if I wanted to do everything, I think. So it's about 50 hours, which is very, very, very decent. And I think this is a game that I could be playing for a lot more hours afterwards because exploring the world and encountering these creatures and, and you know, just going going out to find stuff to craft certain things and upgrade certain things it's just very nice and exploring this world climbing the mountains scouring through the forest it's very very enjoyable this game is really really good and it's definitely one of my top candidates if not the top candidate for game of the year of 2017 regardless of what's going to come out after this if you want to see my full review on the game go check it out right there it's on my other channel you should really go link down in the description or there will be something over here I'm not sure you have to see what my magic fingers and anything will do Spoiler alert, if you haven't bought the game, go on and buy it. That's basically, I can already tell you that that's what the review is going to say. If you haven't bought the game yet and you own a PS4, seriously, if you have the money to spare, go and buy this game. It You won't regret it. It's amazing and it's so much better than even I expected it to be. It's made by a Dutch company, a small Dutch gaming company, uh, which makes me feel kind of proud because, you know, it was the whole thing with The Witcher 3 as well. Like The entirety of Poland felt proud because they brought out such an amazing game and rightfully so. And I feel the same way now with of course my countrymen who from guerrilla games who um who made this game and made an absolute gem out of it and i guess that's about it that wraps it up if you're dutch you can vote make sure to go vote 15th of march don't miss out use your vote do it let me know what you want to see differently on the channel if there's anything at all and how i can improve and everything because i want to get the views up i want to get people to be interested in my content again i've tried several things so far it's not working leave it down in the description in the description no that's where i do things comments that's where you belong check out my patreon account if you're interested it would fairly appreciate it if you did and if you can seriously Go buy Horizon Zero Dawn. Oh, and watch my review on it, you know? Because why not? Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you found it helpful. Uh, I was lovely chatting with you. Again, I would really love to hear your comments. I want to talk to you. I want to interact with you more. I just, you know, not having that happen because there's not a lot of things going on in the channel. It feels bad. I want to talk to you. I want to interact with you. Hit me up on Twitter. Link down in the description as well. I will definitely talk to you on Twitter as well. I try to respond as many things as I can. I want to talk to you. I want to, I want to interact. You know, you feel like my friends and I want to act like that. And it's very sad to see that none of, that none of my friends or just a small part of my friends are turning up for these videos so you know get in touch with me Col comment me tweet me whatever let me know how i can improve let me know what you think might be able to improve just know f interact with me again i would really really enjoy that because i miss that at the moment thanks again and until the next time bye bye